6.13, welcome back. Good morning, San Antonio. Parents, listen up because we got some rocket fuel and mac and cheese might have a little bit more in common than you ever imagined. So much so that you might be eating them. Yeah, never thought of this combination, but as our digital journalist Ivan Edita tells us, a harsh chemical found in rockets, missiles, and explosives may actually be at your family's dinner table and the consequences could be dangerous. It's hardly a household name, but perchlorate is a chemical that helps rockets reach for the stars and alarmingly, also our dinner plates. Perchlorates can enter our food and water via water that's used to irrigate the crops. It can also be contained in the plastic containers that we use to store our food. How serious is the problem? Consumer Reports' recent tests found perchlorate in two thirds of food samples. With the highest levels in baby food, fast food, and fresh produce, such as box mac and cheese and baby rice cereal, and even in some healthier options like cucumbers and baby carrots. While no single serving exceeded safety limits, multiple servings throughout the day could add up to concerning levels, especially for kids. We're concerned because perchlorate can disrupt thyroid function, potentially affecting metabolism in adults and brain development in children. CR reached out to several food companies, including major baby food manufacturers, about these findings. None have provided comments so far on whether they're aware of and taking steps to minimize it in their products. And if you're wondering if scientists only just discovered that perchlorate is a problem in water and food, think again. It's been a known contaminant for years. Unfortunately, while our federal regulators have known about this problem for decades, they have been slow to act. The EPA is now under court order to propose limits on perchlorate in drinking water by November 2025. So what can you do now to improve the safety of the food you feed your family? Parents should be aware of these issues, but should not panic. They can reduce the risk of these chemicals to their children by feeding them a varied and healthy diet. Also, getting adequate iodine intake can help offset perchlorate's effects. Foods like whole wheat bread, seafood, dairy products, and eggs can help you get your daily dosage of iodine without the extra sodium from iodized salt. Ivan Herrera, KSAT 12 News.